In this video, I'll explain how you can perform a system recovery using external recovery media, such as a recovery USB stick, on your Windows 8 computer. For performing a system recovery on a Windows 7 Toshiba computer, see our other video. Performing a system recovery restores your computer to the original factory image and erases all existing data. This includes files, folders, programs, drivers, emails, and photos. Before performing a system recovery, back up all personal files if possible. If you have not backed up your personal files, the data will be lost. You can also perform a system recovery from the hard drive recovery utility, but this is explained in another video. If you're able to start the computer into Windows successfully, you'll need to completely shut Windows down. You can do this by holding the Windows key down and pressing the C key. Then select Settings, then Power, then hold the Shift key down and select Shutdown. While the computer's off, connect your recovery USB stick. Turn on the computer. When the initial Toshiba splash screen appears, press F12. The boot menu should appear. If the boot menu does not appear, shut down the computer and try again, holding F12 as you start it. In the boot menu, select the USB option to boot from the recovery USB stick. You should see a warning screen explaining the process. Depending on your model, you might see a different screen. Read the information on the screen and then continue following the prompts. The prompts will lead you through the entire recovery process. You should now know how to perform a system recovery using recovery media on your Windows 8 computer. For more information, visit support.toshiba.com.